and Junior with us, sir. Uh, tomorrow we will call a fight between Gowatsky and uh, Usyk for the WO belt. What are your expectations before this fight? Well, uh, I think it's very clear this is a very close fight. Uh, two very good fighters undefeated, with, both with a lot of experience. My expectations is that whoever has the better chin, is in better condition, is going to win this. I expect it to go 12 rounds. Even though they're knockout punchers, they're two elite fighters who are ready to go the distance. Do you follow boxing? Are you interested in boxing? Yeah, I follow boxing, of, of course. It's uh, my favorite sport. I, when I'm not announcing, I'm watching. and. Uh, it's also my business, so I, I like to keep up with uh, with boxing. So, you know, this is one that the, the fans should be very excited about, and uh, anything can happen in this fight. You called uh, many great fights. Who is your favorite boxer? Well, that's a difficult question. Through the years, it has changed. As a as a young man, I as a boy, I grew up, and my uh, sport heroes were boxers from Los Angeles. Ones like maybe you've never heard of, but Danny Little, Red Lopez, and Mando Ramos, and some of those great fighters. Uh, and then Alexis Arguello, a great champion from uh, Nicaragua. As I got a little bit older, uh, some of my first fights were Julio Cesar Chavez. Some of my first world title fights. So he was my favorite. And then so it's changed throughout the years. I like boxers who. Who, um, don't run from other fighters. I like boxers who um, who have good character and good heart and uh, and uh, are good people also. And so I have many favorites. What was uh, the the fight with the best uh, atmosphere? Uh, you announced. That's difficult to say. I did many many fights of Mike Tyson, and there's nothing like a Mike Tyson fight. The the fans stand up almost the whole time and and when he would swing and miss they would cheer and didn't matter if he hit somebody that was very exciting but one fight stands out more than any other and that's the largest crowd ever to see a fight and that was Julio Cesar Chavez versus Greg Haugen and there were 135,000 people in the uh, the stadium in Mexico City and that was an unbelievable atmosphere it was something that I think can never be surpassed so I would choose that number one but many others close behind Lennox Lewis versus Tyson or Mayweather Pacquiao? Uh, Lennox Lewis versus Mike Tyson was a crazy atmosphere because of the animosity between the fighters and the guards standing in the ring and oh, it was just crazy. Um, th that was a, a crazy, crazy atmosphere. You know, with uh, uh, Pacquiao and uh, Mayweather, that was a good atmosphere because it was a fight that we wanted to see for so long and finally it was happening. But I'll say this, that you know, thinking of this fight being here in Poland, the atmosphere is almost more exciting than those because here everyone has a great concern who's going to win. They, 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 you know, love their local fighters. In the big fights in Las Vegas, sometimes it's the wealthy who are there and show up at the last minute, maybe are not as loud. So honestly, I like this fight here.